heard about how you were, how you found out you were a semi-finalist for the award. Is, is there any story behind how you found out you were a finalist for the award? No, nah, there's no story this time, but being a finalist is different than being a semi-finalist. You know, one and three, but I'm just going to stay in attack mode because I know the other, the other two that's in the finalists is still working. So I got to make sure I outwork everybody. How many jugs uh, balls did you catch today? I don't even count no more. I just get out there and just catch. <laughs> yeah, coach says you like to do it. I'm 200 a day. Yeah, I just, I just make sure I'm staying out there to build my confidence. Mm -hmm. What stands out to you about going into this game? I know everyone's kind of looking ahead to the championship, but you guys have Syracuse this weekend. What stands out about them? Um, you know, it's another game, so that means it's a big game. I know I'm not looking ahead, so I'm going to make sure that the receivers aren't as well. We've got to go 1-0 and every day this week, not just on Saturday. So we're going to make sure we're doing everything that we can on and off the field to be successful. Jordan, I think that Bolitnikoff voting ends before the AC championship game. So is this Syracuse game, do you, you think of this as an, uh, an opportunity to kind of keep proving yourself to, to everyone? Every week is a new opportunity for me. I'm not thinking about it as the award. I'm just trying to make sure I go out there and put myself in a position to help the team win. And I know when we win as a team, all the accolades will come. What does Trey Tipton mean to the wide receiver room? You mean wisdom. He means a lot. You know, he can teach the younger guys. He teaches the older guys, too. For me, he just shows me. He just motivates me to, to do anything. All the things that he has been through over time, and he just keeps going. He just shows me how to face adversity. Jordan, along that line, how much do you know about what he's been through? And is it kind of amazing for you guys to see the way he carries himself? It's, 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 it's just amazing to, that all the things that he has been through on and off the field and just to see him keep going and coming here every day and keep working is just mind blowing really. Does he inspire you guys? He inspires everybody on his team. You guys have already nailed down the end of the birth of the championship game. Do you expect that, that fact to, expect, uh, to affect your usage in the Syracuse game? How much you might play or not play? I don't think it'll affect my usage. We want to win any and every game. This is a this is a big game too. Last game of the season. It's their senior day. They're they're what, they're five and six. They're trying to get into a bowl game. So we got to treat this game like it is a championship. Is it like hard to focus at all with the holiday like coming up this week, or is, do you have any like plans for Thanksgiving? Like, how's that kind of work? Uh, well, my mom was coming up here to cook, so I want to shout her out for that. Thank you. <laughs> but other than that. It's, we still in season, so it's go time for us. Everybody trying to eat. We're not getting complacent. We're not satisfied yet. So I don't think the holidays mean too much. What's the best thing she makes? I'll say her stuffing. <laughs> how, many guys, how many guys is she cooking for? Whoever come over, hopefully that we can get the whole team over there. Open invitation? <laughs> Open invitation. Cool. Free invite. <laughs>